Hey everybody, the Rogue G3 here, coming back at you to play, well, the original Call of Duty on PC. So, I actually got these bundle of games on Steam, and I really wanted to play them, but because, I mean, I have some decent experience with the Call of Duty franchise. I play Call of Duty Finest Hour on the GameCube, and I have all the Modern Warfare games and the Black Ops games as well, and not the best, not the worst, but I fairly like it. Um, so we're go one of the reasons I want to hit on these older ones is kind of to just look back at the history of some of these games, you know? So we'll go on regular difficulty because I think veteran would blow me away, but I'm not too green. So let's go ahead and get started. Tap Coca. All right, listen Toka? up. Private Martin, you're on the obstacle course and doing weapons training today. I'm Private Martin. Before starting the obstacle course, read each of these important signs and do what they tell you. Captain Foley? Or, yeah, that's Captain Foley. Okay. Damn, Captain. Okay. Okay, so all these. Good. Now check your objectives. All right. You'll notice that your current objective is highlighted. In addition, the location of your current objective is marked by the star on your compass. As you approach your current objective, the star will move toward the center of your compass. Approach your current objective. Hi, Captain. Okay. That's it. Close enough. You will notice that objective is checked off and you now have a new one. All right, Martin. Open the gate and run the obstacle course. Hi. Martin, good to see you. They got uh, your sorry butt here too, huh? Apparently. Hey. Good luck. Thanks. Move it, ladies. This is not your Aunt Fanny's dance. I don't have an Aunt Fanny. Eh. Okay, okay, okay. Eh. Eh. Okay. Ah, damn it. Okay. Is that you, Steve Bloom? Come on, Elder. Get the lead out. Yeah, that's you, Steve Bloom. I love your work, man. Not I love Cowboy Bebop. Now hit the dirt and crawl forward under the barbed wire. Mm hmm. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good, Sergeant, right? Fire up those machine guns. What? That's fucked up. Been necessary, don't you think? <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go! Man. Okay. Private Martin, proceed through that door. Sergeant Moody's gonna take you through weapons training. I can ladies, stay right here. Why am I so special? Okay, okay, okay. Eyes up, Private. I'm up here. In the observation tower. Hi, Sergeant Grab Moody. One of those M1A1 carbines from the table. Cool. Ah. To get more ammo, grab it from any loose weapon Boom. of the same type. Approach the fence and fire six rounds at your target. Your accuracy will be defined by the tightness of your crosshair. Fire six more rounds at your target in different stances and watch the and in the crouching or prone position. Hmm. These skills could mean your life. All right, Private. Move on to the Can next Can I area. shoot the sergeant? Grab up a Springfield <laughs> rifle from the table. Switching I've almost your accepted carbine. to do it. <laughs> Turn to the left. Move to the fence and fire two rounds eh. at your target. And eh. now fire two rounds at your target while aiming down your sights. All right. I hope it's clear to you that you will be more accurate while aiming down the sight. All right, Private. Move I really want to see area. what happens when I shoot if I Exchange shoot him. Exchange your Springfield <laughs> for one of the Thompson submachine guns Ooh. on the table. Tommy gun. Unless Fuck yeah. you've got three. <laughs> Besides your sidearm and grenade, take a few steps while aiming down your sight. What? In close quarters combat, you can hit your enemy with the butt end of your weapon. This is okay. called a melee attack. Yeah. Try it with your Thompson. Man. Don't screw around, kid. This. Don't tell me what to do. Which weapons, Private? Unless you're as dumb as you are ugly. Fuck it you. It dawn on you that each weapon is good for different situations. Make and you could buy the farm. I don't get what that metaphor was for. Eh. Come on, man. Why keep shooting this thing? If 
Fire three more rounds at your target. Just three? Private, proceed to the next area. Okay. Pick up the frag grenades from the table. Cool. Pick them up. All right. I'm grenade damn. Each of the openings before you. Rock and fire. Okay. Oh shit. Move behind the concrete. Lean out to the left, then the right. This will help protect you oh, from the enemy. Okay. Shit. All right. Boom. Boom. Move on to the next area. Remember, Private, if you get hurt, grab one of those health kits and use it. Don't be a hero. They will save your life. Our last station will be explosives. <laughs> go ahead, go on. All right. Okay, I'm having too much. I'm having fun. That's a lot <laughs> I'm of too much. Power there. Treated with respect. That stuff doesn't Woo! Care blows up. Note that a stopwatch has appeared. This will tell you how much time you have to get your butt out of there unless you want to go Okay, and just because Good I job, private. Well done. Keep your weapons with you and clean at all times. You are dismissed. Ah! <laughs> you are dismissed. <laughs> you are dismissed. Cool. We're okay. We're good. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that would have court martialed my ass. Ah. Baker Company, listen up. Alrighty. This is the big one. Operation Overlord. Oh, the damn. Seaborne Invasion of Normandy. On H hour D Day, Seaborne Infantry will attack five beaches. Are we going to cover this? Utah, oh, this is... Omaha, Gold, Juno, and Sword here on the coast of Normandy. Utah and Omaha beaches will be attacked by three of our infantry divisions. At the same time, two British and one Canadian division will hit Gold, Juno, and Sword Beaches. The Airborne will be landing six hours before H hour, before the air and naval bombardments. The British 6th Airborne Division will be landing here. At the same time, the 101st and the 82nd Airborne will be landing in these areas. The Dudes River Estuary here mm. divides Utah and Omaha Beach. The mission of the 101st is to capture the Dews River crossings linking Utah and Omaha Beach and to protect the flanks of Utah Beach. This road here is the main highway that connects the entire Cotentin Peninsula. The Germans have troop concentrations in this region. When those troops are mobilized into a counterattack on the beaches, they'll have to move along this road. The 101st is going to make sure that doesn't happen. Baker Company, that's us, has been assigned this causeway here. The Pathfinders, like Private Martin, will be dropped ahead of the main force and will plant beacons on the ground to mark the landing zones. However, there is no telling what will happen once we're on the ground. So I want all of you to learn the objectives of every unit in both the 101st and 82nd. I also want you to study these maps and photographs until you've memorized them. We will be landing behind the Atlantic Wall oh, cool. between several German garrisons. General can't Eisenhower. expect to be relieved until at least several hours after H hour. This is what we've been training for. Good luck. This is what I liked about the older Call of Duty games. You could actually learn quite a bit, and this is historically accurate. That's pretty cool. Oh! Alright, let's go. We good. Uh, we got with Sergeant Heath. Aight. Oh, that German? Yep. <laughs> Sorry, man, but we're just on the opposing side of the war. Uh, ew. Oh. Mm. Ah. 
Sorry, Sarge. Talking shit about Roosevelt and Churchill. Uh, this is Germans. They look like regular, regular Wehrmacht troops. Boosh. Sorry. All right. Oh. Flat chest. Okay. Uh. Oh, okay. Let's go. Ooh, he's getting tense. Alrighty. Air raid. For this shit. The problem with my gun is simple. This thing is weak. Okay? It only has an effective range of like 300 yards or some shit. Last time I checked. Okay. Hey, Sarge. Let's go. Eh, okay. Fire in the hole! <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh, oh, fuck, 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 fuck. fuck. Ah. Oi! Get out of my way! Damn! I do not want to get shot right now. Ah. Oh, fuck. Ow! Brick. Okay, yeah, I much prefer the uh, original M1. Even though I can't reload it, motherfucker. Ooh. Oh, fuck that. Ah, bitch. Guys, don't get in my way. You're gonna get me killed. Ah. Yeah. Oh fuck. Woo this thing's crazy. Clear. Clear. Oh shit. Grenades solve every problem. There we go. Oh, fuck. Okay. We're clear. We're good. Everyone all right? Yeah, we're right. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Is that you, Bloob? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to shoot you. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to actually leave it from here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get back to this next time. This is the Rogue G3 signing off. Later guys. Hey everybody, thank you very much for watching my video. I do appreciate it. If you liked it, then click that like button. It helps my channel grow. And if you want to keep an eye out for more content, then hit that subscribe button. That way you can always keep in touch when I'm uploading videos. And wonderful news, my job is starting to taper off of the overtime, so that gives me much more time to record, edit, and render. Yay! Keep an eye out for new videos soon. Thanks guys, have a great day.